senior political officials of the Roman state had to take auspices before any major political event, like elections and before a battle. They would draw on the expertise of an augur from the College of Augurs. Membership of the College of Augurs was for life, with new members elected periodically. Two of the main kinds of auspices that were deliberately taken involved birds. One type involved watching for the flights of specific kinds of birds – eagles, vultures, buzzards or woodpeckers – or listening for the cries of birds – crows, owls and eagles. You had to work out whether the birds were good or bad, and this was determined partially by where they appeared in the sky in relation to a grid that crisscrossed where the viewer stood the height at which they flew, and the speed and noise of their wing movements. The other main method of bird divination involved observing whether or not the sacred chickens ate the food that was given to them. You had to take auspices at night, and they were valid only for the day to come. So if the activity you were taking auspices for was continued or delayed, you had to repeat them. Even though you were only looking for a yes or no on the timing of the event, the law was complicated and open to interpretation and to challenges. Even if the day had been cleared for the activity, other officers of state could claim to see spontaneous signs from the gods that meant that the event had to be cancelled. 